Megan the Tyrant. Cruel French take brutal swipe at Duchess face over bullying scandal. A French magazine has questioned if Meghan Markle is tyrannical following claims a palace report on allegations she bullied staff has been buried. Gala magazine ran an article with the headline, Tyrannical Meghan Markle? These overwhelming discoveries that will never be revealed. It comes after reports that the findings of an investigation into allegations the Duchess of Sussex bullied royal staff, which she denies, will never be published. According, Buckingham Palace no longer plans to make a public statement on the inquiry. However, changes to the royal household's HR policies as a result of the probe are expected to be published in the annual Sovereign Grant Report. The move is reportedly aimed at limiting tensions between the Sussexes and the royals. Meghan's lawyers previously branded bullying allegations, first reported in March 2021, as a calculated smear campaign before her and Prince Harry's Oprah Winfrey interview. Prince Harry is claimed to be thinking of giving up his Duke of Sussex title, a royal expert said. Some of those involved are upset as they have not even been told the results of the probe, the newspaper reports. Changes to the palace's HR policies are expected to be published in the annual Sovereign Grant report later this month. The investigation focused on claims that the Duchess of Sussex bullied two PAs out of their jobs. Meghan's lawyers branded the allegations a calculated smear campaign launched ahead of her interview with Oprah. The Duchess of Sussex was accused of humiliating palace workers in meetings was said to have shouted at them and governed by fear, according to one author. Prince Harry returned to the royal fold for the Queen's Jubilee celebrations, but his and Meghan Markle's relegated seats were a telling sign of their change in status. Far across the aisle from the Prince of Wales, the Duchess of Cornwall and the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge, Harry and Meghan sat in the second row, behind the Wessex family and the Duke and Duchess of Gloucester. This has sparked Harry to rethink his royal title, royal expert Neil Sean has claimed. Speaking on his YouTube channel, Mr. Sean said, Prince Harry was very vocal about being trapped within the British monarchy. He claimed that he was living in a goldfish bowl which is really conflicting when he wanted to dash over for the Platinum Jubilee celebrations to make sure that he was seen. It's very difficult when you're paymasters like Netflix and Spotify, you're a celebrity, not a royal. Apparently he's not gone off in a bit of a huff because of the way he was treated at the Platinum Jubilee. Prince Harry think that perhaps it may be a good idea to relinquish the titles that so many people are going on about. Perhaps as individual, he knows that they could never take away the title Prince Harry that's his birthright. A Buckingham Palace investigation into claims that Meghan Markle bullied members of her staff will never be published, according to reports. The palace has reportedly improved its HR policies and procedures as a result of the probe, which was privately funded by the Queen, but no longer plans to make any public statement about the inquiry or publicly acknowledge the raft of changes. An independent law firm carried out the inquiry, with some participants reportedly left disappointed about the report being buried. The claims the report is being kept secret to protect those who took part and also to avoid further clashes between the Sussexes and the palace. Meghan's closest friends and former acting colleagues denied the claims and said they couldn't be more different to the kind person they know and love. Royal author Robert Lacey detailed tensions within the royal household stretching back as far back as 2017. According to his book Battle of the Brothers, Prince William was very concerned after finding out about allegations of bullying made against Meghan. Out about allegations.